There have been many times in my life where I felt lost, where I felt scared, where I felt like I just didn't know what to do. I was scared because I felt like I had no control over my life. I felt like I just didn't have the answer that I so desperately needed. I felt such an emptiness inside of me. I spent many, many years trying to fill it and trying to find the answer. Searching. I kept searching, searching, searching. And I spent many years doing things, seeking out things that I thought would bring me ultimate happiness. I took myself on many adventures and I would sort of fixate on certain things that I thought would make me happy. Um, when I was about 16, I thought that a boyfriend would make me happy. I thought being loved and being the object of someone's attention would make me so happy. And you know what? It did for a couple months. But um, that life does not work that way. The feeling faded and reality set in and I realized this was not the answer. So next I thought that looking perfect would make me happy. I needed to be beautiful. That if I just got rid of all my imperfections, if I was like smoking hot 24 7, I would just be ridiculously happy for the rest of my life. Well of course that's not true and as I learned more and did more reflection, I realized that that would not make me happy. The next thing I went chasing was money. So I I went to an oil sound town and I managed to get an extremely high paying job. I was 20 years old and I was making more than I knew what to do with and I basically could do whatever I wanted because I did not have any financial obligations, I was not in debt, I didn't have any payments to make so I kind of just kept accumulating large amounts of money and I could go anywhere I wanted, I could do whatever I wanted because I had so much money. You know, obviously there's a limit but I'm sure you know what I mean. And I just remember staring into my bank account thinking, why don't I feel happy? Why do I feel like I still don't know what to do with myself? Why haven't I solved this problem? Why do I still feel empty? It wasn't until I was at my lowest of lows in my life where I had no money, I had no place, <clears throat> and I was living at a friend's with my two children where I came across a few mentors on the internet and a few books and they completely turned my life around. All of these books, all of these videos, all of these people taught me one extremely important principle that saved me. I discovered a secret and allowed me to pick myself up and build a life for myself, regain control and happiness. Everything you ever wanted is already inside of you. It exists. You just have to allow it to flower. Now I know this is like a very abstract, weird, philosophical mantra. And you might be thinking, really? Because when I first heard this, I was very skeptical. The more and more I read and learned, I just kept hearing the same message over and over and over again in different forms depending on the person because everybody has a different experience of life. It just kept coming up in different ways. There is a wisdom within you, within everybody, and it's always there. It is always speaking to you. Sometimes you just don't notice it because you are consumed with things in life that do not matter. But when you take the time to listen to your heart and yourself, you realize that you do know what to do. The answers start coming to you. There are many different names for this wisdom within you. Some people call it the universe, you could call it God, your inner voice, Jiminy Cricket, your intuition, signs. It's all the same thing. It is the same thing. It comes from the same source. You have to find your way back to that. You have to have faith in this wisdom, in you, in yourself, in your capabilities, in your gifts, in your strengths. Have faith in that. Trust in that. Know that these things will get you to where you want to be and allow you to become who you were meant to be. And you have the capability to be resourceful to attain whatever you 
one. This really isn't much of a secret. Many great, amazing, accomplished people who have done insane, mind-blowing things all know this secret. Most of them have expressed it in some way or another. These people are the same as you. They are just a human with the same fears and the same uncertainties and doubts as you. The only difference is they lived by this secret. They kept it close to their heart and they never forgot that secret. So tell me, are you going to live it too? You might be asking yourself, well, how am I supposed to know what this inner voice is? How am I supposed to know when it's speaking to me? It speaks in many different ways. I've heard stories where it has been a literal voice in someone's head. A lot of the times it's certain emotions. A lot of the times it's an experience. Or it could be just a set of strange events that happen sequentially that just, it seems like the universe is giving you a message. Many, many different forms. All I can really say, at least from my experience, is that you will just know. It's kind of the same thing as when you fall in love. You can't really explain what it's like if somebody who hasn't been in love is asking you, what is it like to be in love? Words do not properly convey what it is to be in love. It's the same thing with your inner voice. It's just something that you know. If you haven't seen my video, How to Find Your Purpose Yet, that is another really good resource to try to tap into that inner voice. I just want to end this video by saying, don't give up on the magic that is within you. Ignite it, set it on fire, and see where it takes you. Okay guys, I will see you next video. I love you all. Take care of yourselves. Listen to your inner voice. Bye.